How many football games a year do you guys show? Just one? Just one. Football Just the Super Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, we don't have any idea like what's going on. <laughs> we got a we got a streaker on the field. We're going streaking. We're going to the quads. We're streaking. <laughs> You guys know where we can watch the Super Bowl? Well, I'm up, I'm showered, I'm ready, kinda. Unlike this guy over here, he's still snoozing. You're in bed, trying to act like uh, I didn't just get up and shower and get my affairs in order for the big day. Like, what's going on here? What's going on here, fella? Huh? Come on, let's go, let's go. It's go time. Game starts in 10 minutes. Come on, buddy, let's go. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Come on. Let's go. It's Super Bowl time. So it's been a bit of a frustrating morning. We've uh, tried to book a grab like six times and we've been denied every single time. Just pulled over a taxi here. We're sitting near the train station. They tell us that these trains don't go to Demonsara where we're trying to get to to watch the Super Bowl. And we just pulled over a taxi and he pulled over and he said he wouldn't take us. So. Brian might have a bite on his phone. He might have one. Did you say the guy messaged you and said he was coming? He did. He's like, I'm on our, way. I'm on my way. And I said, <laughs> we are waiting. <laughs> found we're else to go. we're de we're gonna miss kickoff, and we're we're definitely waiting. Well, we found a cab. Got a grab, I guess. Not a cab. And we are on our way. Lock, stock, and barrel. So we got a hot tip that. Uh, Sid's Pub in Demonsara was going to be playing the Super Bowl. In reality, we have absolutely no idea if we're going to actually catch it there or not, but hoping for the best. Do you think they'll be showing the Super Bowl at uh, Sid's Pub in Demonsara? Sid's Pub? Yeah. Do you think they'll have the Super Bowl? I didn't know. You don't know? <laughs> well, <laughs> here we go. We'll, we'll wait and see, I guess. <laughs> Time will tell. Time will tell. Oh, boy. We have arrived. Uh oh. Well, I was going to say moment of truth, but uh, there might be. There might even be a line up there. To get in. Oh, boy, it's packed. It is absolutely yeah. packed. I knew we needed to come early. Wow. This guy's got a Cowboys jersey on. Right. Hey, the man, good sir. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we're here. Here we go. Wow, look at this crowd. I knew it was going to be close to the door. That's not my door, that's your door. Wow, look at this guy. Crazy, crazy. Look at all of this. <laughs> Well, Brian's angry because we pretty much can't get in. <laughs> so, we're standing outside on the street. Well, I wish we would have gotten up earlier. <laughs> wish we weren't sleeping so goddamn long. In the shower, come out, he's still sleeping. I had a feeling this was going to happen. I had a feeling that we should have called yesterday too. I was thinking that we should have called and made a booking. The early bird they say gets the worm, and they're not wrong. They're not wrong. Whoever made that saying up, accurate, accurate. All right, we're aboarding mission. That was called Sid's Pub. Now we're heading down to a place called the Sticky Wicket. 
because that one's absolutely packed and there's just nowhere to sit. So might have to go back there and stand on the street, but oh, great, great. Something, something just happened. We're missing it. We're missing it. Well, we've arrived. We got our seats at the bar. <laughs> I guess we uh, probably should have reserved yesterday, but uh, we had the feeling feeling that this place was not going to be busy. Who knew you can reserve a Super Bowl? Who wants to watch the Super Bowl in Kuala Lumpur? You know, a couple of schmucks like us, no one else, right? So, go Niners. I just want to uh, apologize to all the Swifties um, for what my friend Brian just said. Uh, he's not hes not really rooting for the 49ers. He would, he would never do that to you guys. He wouldn't. Oh, I would. <laughs> <laughs> so we got here and we walked up to the table that's behind us. That's still empty. And we sat down and the waiter comes up to us and tells us... At that table's reserved. Holy! And the people beside us have it reserved for their friends that are coming in like an hour. It, it, it is, we and are, it's super busy in here. <laughs> we are well into the second quarter. This place is packed. The place down the road is absolutely packed. There is just a perfect booth behind us. No one's touching it. No one's allowed to sit there. There's been multiple people walk up and ask if they can use it. And, they, and the guy said, uh, it's reserved for when my kids wake up. I was like, I was like, when's that going to be? He's like, I don't know, maybe 45 minutes to an hour from now. Like, like if you're not a Super Bowl fan and you're not here at kickoff, like where I'm from, there's no table reservation. If you're not here, like they're not going to let a table in a packed house like this sit around for an hour plus. Like paying customers are like, hey. Country. We're in a different place. Can't be the same everywhere you go in the world. Well, it's not uh, Super Bowl Monday without a good old fashioned full English breakfast. Could it be fuller? Yeah. Well, you gotta be happy with what you got in life. That's what I've been told. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I feel like Alicia Keys is at least somewhat saving this halftime show. Because so far... If I ain't got you... Well, we uh, are here at the Sticky Wicket, and got a couple couple English guys here. Gonna just see what they think about the football game. So who are you guys cheering for today? Uh, 49ers. 49ers, me too. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, Are they the team that you normally cheer for in the NFL? Yeah, Cowboys, Bengals. Oh, Cowboys. That's Cowboys. my team right there. Bengals, okay. Yeah. And how long have you guys been in Kuala Lumpur for? Uh, 10 years. 10 years? Yeah. You guys, so you guys work here? I run a business. Oh, a couple yeah. entrepreneurs. 100%. Yeah. Not just handsome, but smart. <laughs> Stop Triple <it. laughs> double <laughs> What time did you guys get here today? Yeah, seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Who are you guys cheering for today? Forty Niners. Forty Niners. Forty Niners. Yeah, that's who I'm cheering for too. Bring it around. Bring it around. Bring it around. Fifty-three yards for the lead. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. You feel good? <laughs> Might go to overtime. Well. We got an even game. We got a tie ball game. Tie Anyone's ball game, game now. Anyone's game. We got like nine minutes left or something like that. And five minutes left. Five minutes left. <laughs> five okay. Minutes. We'll see. I'm kind of rooting for the 49ers here because I don't want the Kansas Chiefs to win again. And I kind of want to see Taylor surprise. Nothing wrong with that. We'll see. Wow. That's massive for Kansas City and the Swifties. Here we go. To go to overtime. Super Bowl. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Be it. Be it. This is it. It's a game. Oh, That's the game, folks. That's the game. This was the Andy Reid special. The Swifties triumph. The Swifties triumph today. <laughs> Can't outdo the power of the Swifties.
organization. Look how happy she is. So we're just here uh, outside the pub after the game, and I met a fellow Canadian here. Uh, <laughs> hey, Saskatchewan! <laughs> I was just What's curious up? what you thought about the game today. I thought it was going to go to double overtime, actually, but yeah. because I'm a diehard romantic, I wanted Kansas City to win. Yeah, okay, okay. And they did. Woo! We're here today with a seemingly Dallas Cowboys fan. Well, not, not really, not really. Well, well, yeah, you got the yeah, shirt yeah. on, you're repping yeah, it, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah sure, sure. Well, what do you think of the game today? It was great, yeah. yeah. It was uh, very difficult towards yeah. the end. And I was thinking that Kansas was going to lose, right? They were yeah. down the entire game. And yeah, yeah, well, finally, wow, right at the last possession. Third down, right? Yeah. He got a touchdown. And, and, and next and sure, year, who's, yeah. who's winning next year? Dallas Cowboys, right? Yeah. Yeah. Always next year. Always next year. Yeah. Always next year. Yeah. All right, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I appreciate the time. All Have right. a good day. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Yeah. Well, it looks like Kansas City took it this year. San Francisco drove the field. They had their chance. They couldn't make it happen. Got that field goal, but I had a feeling that it wasn't going to be enough. The Swifties took it this year. Kansas City. It's the first time any team has won two championships back to back in like 19, 20 years. So good on them. I don't really like either of these teams that much, but uh, you know, that's the sports game. Next year, Dallas Cowboys are coming. You better hold your breath, because we're gonna come in lock, stock, and barrel, storm in the league, and we're getting that championship next year, so you hold on, you wait tight, it's coming.